And it has only been a week since we have been back from Mexico and um, today we are already heading back to the airport. Uh, this time we are headed to a different airport though because we are flying Porter. It is my first time flying Porter and uh, Jason has flown it before. So I'm uh, interested in seeing what that experience is like. It's a much, much smaller airport so the whole process will be a lot less involved. Um, we are going to Ottawa because Jason has a conference on Monday. It's a one day conference, but we decided that it would be a nice excuse to get away. Our anniversary is actually tomorrow on uh, Saturday, November 20th. So it's actually another nice excuse, even though we already kind of celebrated our anniversary going to Mexico. On our actual anniversary, we have a chance to also get away. So we're gonna go to, we're heading to Ottawa today so we can spend the weekend there. Jason also has a family in the Ottawa area, so we it's a good excuse to hang out with them celebrate our anniversary and then he will go to the conference on Monday. So it's now 6 p.m. and we're just now leaving for our 8 p.m. flight, um, which makes me a little bit nervous, but Jason assures me that it's fine. So uh, we'll see how it goes. Very quick, very shaky, very loud. Only nine o'clock and this airport is absolutely dead. <laughs> like completely dead, closed up, done for the night. <laughs> so now we just have to collect our baggage and then find our way to our hotel. Luckily we found sandwiches in the airport so we're not too hungry. But we're probably gonna wanna find some more food when we get to the hotel. So random, you bring the darkness to the light, split the atom. I ignore the fact that this will never last. Your words come out so soothing that I forget that this thing is confusing. Having such a blast, but don't ask where my head is at. Cause I'm cruising through the rush of us. I don't care about love, just need your touch. We just arrived here at the Westin in Ottawa and our uh, view is not too bad. I think we're probably going to unpack and then try to hunt down some food for Jason because room service evidently closes at 9pm. So three people over, you know, 
doing a bureaucratic slam. Okay, you need them all here. Okay, this is not enough. This You're not, okay, uh, first of all, sit down and see what the I'm height is on that, like okay? type like this. <laughs> wait, wait, <laughs> so, Anyways, so we were just about to unpack when we realized that in this whole hotel room, they have three drawers. See them, one, two, three. And this tiny, tiny closet. And that's literally it. And here's the thing. It's not a small hotel room. That's what I said. There are multiple places in this hotel room that they could have put storage. Um, one of them is here. I'm not really sure what this is even for. It looks like where the mini fridge should be, but the mini fridge is over there. So, I'm really not sure what they will intended this to be used for. There's just this entire hallway here where they could have put like a dresser or a closet along this wall. Most frustrating of all though is this thing that they have under the TV, which doesn't serve a purpose because there's a desk here, so it's not a desk. But like this drawer doesn't open. And this one holds the safe. So I'm not really sure why they chose this instead of a dresser. I don't know how they expect two people to be able to unpack in here. For we're not we're not even staying that long. We're staying here for like a weekend, four nights, and like there's nowhere to put anything. So we're making our way out into the night to find food. <laughs> Sounds like dramatic. I'm all about your vibe, vibe, vibe. Me and you got that good, yeah, but I'm running like I'm lost in the woods, yeah. I don't really care. I just like it here Me and you can't get enough No, you know, act it, but I know this is a blur flow Having such a blast But don't ask where my head is at Cause I'm cruising through the rush of us I don't care about love, just need your touch Once you do some sites uh, we didn't get any food so we're gonna try and order something in it's getting really late now we're just gonna eat and uh, then probably go to bed I'm all about your vibe. 